Moon Knight, episode four. Disassociative identity disorder or schizophrenia. What's the difference between them? And what does this have to do with Moon Knight? Spoiler alert for episode four and trigger warning. The plot twist in episode four has got us thinking about Mark's recent experiences and whether this is down to his DID or whether he's experiencing psychotic symptoms, which are part of schizophrenia. In the psychiatric ward, Mark comes to, like waking up when you're already awake, and is confused about where he is and how he got there. This is what it can feel like when someone with dissociative identity disorder switches personality. If you want more information on DID, check out our other videos on Moon Knight and click the like button. When looking at the hospital from Mark's perspective, it can appear as if he's having a psychotic episode. All of the people he knows are there, but they have different roles and relationships to him. The setting isn't what he's used to seeing, and he's confused as to which version of reality is the real one. Psychosis is a condition that affects the way your brain processes information. It causes you to lose touch with reality. A person in psychosis will see, hear, and believe things that aren't real, having hallucinations or delusions. Psychosis is a symptom, not an illness. It can be triggered by physical illness, mental illness, such as schizophrenia, substance abuse, extreme stress or trauma, the onset is usually late teens to early adulthood. Schizophrenia is characterized by continuous or relapsing episodes of psychosis, which can include delusions, hallucinations, disorganized speech, and negative symptoms such as social withdrawal and flat affect. Is Mark having multiple episodes of psychosis when he jumps from city to Egypt to the hospital? So by the end of episode four, we don't know which version of reality is the real one and which one is made up inside of Mark's head. Having a psychotic episode can feel like you're in an alternate universe, hearing and seeing and experiencing things differently, even though in reality, to other people, nothing has changed. This can feel very confusing and distressing. In addition to schizophrenia, people with DID may also experience psychotic episodes. So if Mark is having a psychotic episode, it could be part of his DID, or it could be that he also has schizophrenia. Around 1% of the population will be diagnosed with schizophrenia in their lifetime. And people with DID also make up roughly 1% of the population. There's also overlap between the two conditions. So that's tens of millions of people. These mental disorders can cause real impairment and it's important to seek professional help if you or someone you know is suffering from any mental disorder. To help us spread more awareness of mental health, like, share, comment and subscribe. See you in the next one.